Hey guys, it's me, your girl, Holly. I'm back with another video. So yeah, the title is just about what the title is. And I had to bring this to my YouTube family because this has been going on in my life in the background of my life. And I just have not just like been showing it, um, sharing it with you guys. But um, it's been plaguing me and, you know, I'm tired. You know, I'm tired of people thinking that it's okay. You know, if you don't like someone or you feel someone is being disrespectful and this and that, why do you keep coming to them? Why do you keep bothering them? Why do you keep asking them for things? I don't think that it's right that people, you know, you're going to allow your children to scratch up my car. Notice that I'm the only one, you know, out here and the only one car that's getting scratched up. I, you know, last year when I first moved down here or whatever, um... You know, they was coming at me and this and that. Um, so something happened to my car and they went to the property manager and she immediately stuck a stick on my car. Got my car. My car was ended up getting towed. I had to call the people to come get it. So I didn't have another a car. But it was cars that had been out here on the property for months and months and months. And she never st stuck a stick on them. You know, so and then you say you're not trying to target me. So this year, I go, I get a car or whatever. A couple of us get, ca get cars, I get a car. And I noticed that all of a sudden, my car scratched up. But I noticed that my car been getting scratched. It ain't just started getting scratched. The first day I got it, y'all was out there scratching it. So yesterday, I go outside to catch my, I'm in my window. And I'm doing something on my bed, but I'm looking out the window. But they can't see me because of how I got my bed proposition on my headboard. So I'm watching my so-called neighbor outside. She gathering up all the children and this and that or whatever. And I'm like, okay. So I see them go over by my car. And I'm like, okay, is she telling them to stay off the cars or this and that? Only to find out she telling them to go and get sticks. A big old wooden stick, a big old iron stick. And having them to go, directing them to go and hit my car and i'm like okay so i go out the door i'm like okay and the problem is what because i stay right across the, right across from you if you got a problem i'm right here why are you hitting the car like for real so she tried to blow it off like she didn't hear me talking to you, like she was out there trying to what's color trying to get the kids to not to hit the cars and stuff like that which you know you're a lie i seen everything I seen everything and it's gone and it's exposed. And she been the one on my car since I got my car. She she got blessed. She went and got her car. She got a car before I got my car. Went and got her car. So I leave, you know. We went through some remodeling. I was telling you guys we went through some remodeling. If you go back over some of my videos, we went through some remodeling um in the apartments. And so we had to go and stay in a hotel. So I go to Atlanta for my, you know. For the time that I had to stay, I go to Atlanta. I come back with my car. I pull up. She outside. First thing come out, I'm after, uh, your car better than your car better than mine. Your car better than mine. How's my car better than yours? You had every option to go and get whatever car you wanted off the lot. You could have went and got a 2020. You could have went and got the same one. You know, ain't nothing wrong with the car you got. Your car nice. So y'all comment down below because this is it's it's crazy. It's ridiculous. And then. If I'm not saying what you want me to say or coming at you a certain way, you got an attitude. It's a problem. But you study doing things. Like, who does that? So, yeah, guys, I, I came. I, I got to share this with my YouTube family because it's just, it's ridiculous. I tell my son, don't hear his friends. Be nice. Play nice with your friends and this and that. But then you low-key telling your child to hit my son, hit my baby. And out there, you see your child doing shit. She ain't got nothing to say. And I'm supposed to let shit go? And I don't mean to be cussing, but yeah, it's just, it's just, it's getting to that point. You know, I'm trying. It's just me and my son. I guess because they, because I'm not from here. And they don't see nobody coming to my house. I guess they think they can just come at a person. You feel me? And it's okay. Because they mama, sister, daddy, uncle, and aunties, and, and cousins all stay out here like, it's it's okay. No, it's not okay. It's not, a, it's not okay. And you ain't dealing with no punk. 
So yeah, guys, let me know. Share this video, like it, subscribe to the channel, please. Um, I'm trying to get to a thousand. I just need a thousand subscribers, guys. That will really bless and help uh me and my son out uh, a long way, so that we can move and do what we gotta do to get away. Because this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. I ain't never seen. I, I ain't never seen what I'm going through. I ain't never seen a day in my life. Oh, yeah, guys. I forgot to include the, um, yeah, the brand new apartments. And here we go. Okay, um, guys. Have a blessing. Bye. And chat.